welcome to the Feather Place channel. My name is Carmen and today I'm going to show you how to make a really fun and flirty carnival bikini top. So to get started with the carnival bikini top, you want to decide what direction you want the feathers to flow in. For my bikini top, I chose for them to flow in a downward direction. So I'm going to start in the bottom corner and make marks with my Sharpie marker and this ruler. So since there's going to be three rows, I know the third row is going to be at the edge of the bikini right here. So the only other mark I need to make is the second row. So once you're finished with one side, you're ready to measure the other side. And next, we're ready to cut our fringe. So I'd like to lay my fringe down just on top of that line and go a little bit past the end of the bikini and make a little snip. So now we're ready to glue our pieces down to our bikini top. Um, if you want a more permanent piece, you can always sew them on to attach them. So the first thing you want to do uh, before you start gluing the pieces down is just to fold the first end under so that it's a little more finished and there's no uh, feathers kind of peeking out. So here we have all of the pieces attached. I think it looks great like this, but I also thought that it needed maybe just a little bit more of a finishing touch. I have this um, nice metallic uh, trim that I'm gonna use. So now we have a fully complete carnival bikini top that uh, is super couture, unique, fun, and it only took a few uh, really simple items. Um, if you have some leftover fringe, which I did, I suggest always saving it for a future project. I um, made this tassel fringe choker that goes really well with this piece. You can find the tutorial for that um, on our channel. Thank you so much for watching and enjoy your bikini time.